What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Fro Thizzle in the building. And today, I'm going to be talking about the absolutely horrendous 2008 film, The Happening, directed by M. Night Shalomon Hayam, starring Marky Mark, Zoe Deschanel, and John Leguizamo. Ain't nothing to it, but to do it. This movie is as bad as people make it out to be. The thing with me was, I actually like the story and the plot. It's still kind of stupid, but with a better writer, or if it was just written better in general, this story could have been pretty dope. The writing's really bad. The acting is really bad. Mine is John Leguizamo, who actually puts in a pretty good performance for this type of fucking movie. This is Zoe Deschanel's absolute worst performance in the history of planet Earth. Wooden, cold, lifeless, emotionless. And even if that was what Shaman Lama Ding Dong was going for, it didn't work. Despite how terrible it all is, there are some golden moments that are absolutely fucking hilarious that have me rolling on the floor in stitches, even if it was 100% unintentional. The line delivery is so fucking odd. They're dying. They're killing themselves. Wait, is it the oxygen? Is it the plants? Right off the bat, when we see Marky Mark, we know how bad this performance is going to be. Look, I don't know if you guys have heard about all the bees going on around right now. What's the first thing he says, yo? Look, I don't know if you guys have heard about this article in the New York Times about honeybees vanishing. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I don't know yo! We're in for a fucking treat. John Leguizamo as the kid's father is the best performance hands down in the fucking movie. He's actually trying. There's some emotion when he delivers the lines. It's actually pretty good, despite how bad the lines are. And there's even a pretty decent part where right before he separates with the group and he says, hey, take my daughter's hand unless you mean it. That's always my favorite part of the film. That's the only part that feels kind of heartfelt, where you're like, yo, that I felt that shit. Another thing that I enjoy from this film, surprisingly, is the death scenes. I think they're pretty good. I like the tiger death scene. It's goofy, but I like it. I like the lawnmower scene where the dude lays down on the ground and lets it run over him. This film had the potential to be an actually really good fucking movie. But under M. Night Shyamalan Ding Dong's direction, it all fucking tears apart and dissolves and just fails miserably. I hear that Shyamalan was intentionally going for like a weird kind of wacky movie feel, but nah, bro. You were trying to make a dead ass serious thriller suspenseful film and it back fucking fired on all cylinders. But despite how bad it is, I do enjoy the happening. This movie's a good watch to absolutely tear apart with your boys. You guys can sit down and just laugh your ass off at this fucking movie and all the horrible choices throughout. The rating for this one is weird because I do enjoy this film, but it's horrible. This film deserves like a one or two out of ten. But I give it a five because it's so fun and it's fun to laugh at and just an awesome movie to rip the fucking shreds. I appreciate y'all for watching. Thank y'all very much. It's been your boy, Fro Thizzle. Subscribe for some more Thizzle reviews. And that's it. I'm out. Peace, nigga.